Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My friends, without any doubt, your Creator is the Lord of the heavens and the earth. Every things you do, where you stand, what you choose to say or conceive, are known by Him. On the judgment day, He would reveal it all in front of you, because Allah knows everything. My friends, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says in Holy Quran, Surah Al-Nur, verse 64, Certainly to Allah belongs all that is in the heavens and the earth. Surely He knows your conditions and the day when they will be brought back to Him. Then He will inform them of what they did. And Allah is all-knower of everything. My friends, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala knows every fallen leaf in your yard. Means there is not a leaf which falls that he does not know about. He knows what is, in, uh, what is on the land and in the sea. My friends, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says in Holy Quran, Surah Al-Anam, chapter 6, verse 59 he has the key to the unseen no one knows them except him and he knows all that he is in the land and sea not even a leaf falls without his knowledge nor a grain in the darkness of the earth or anything green or dry but is written in a clear record my friends, we are committing sin in this world without fear. What we think that Allah is not seeing, what we are doing, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says in Surah Luqman, chapter 31, verse 16, Luqman said, Son, Allah will bring forth everything even if it is as small as the grain of the mustard seed, even thought. It is hidden inside a rock or anywhere in the heavens or earth. Allah is most subtle, all aware. My dear friends, that, that means that is nothing can escape Allah's knowledge and His cracks. A seed in the rock may be hidden for you, but it is known to Allah. A particle in the heaven may be very distant from you. But for Allah, it is very near. A thing lying in the, in the layer of the earth may be lying in darkness for you, but for him is in full light. Therefore, you cannot do anything good or bad anywhere or any time which may remain hidden from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. He is not only aware of it, but when the time for accountability comes, he will place before you a full record of each act of yours. My dear friends, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says in Surah Fatir, chapter 35, verse 38, Surely Allah knows the unseen in the heavens and the earth. He even knows the secret hidden in people's heart. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala knows all the hidden things of the heaven and the earth. He has full knowledge of all that is in human's heart. We do not hide good or bad deeds from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala because Allah is watching us. My friends, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says in Surah Hud, chapter 11, verse 57, Surely my Lord keeps a watch over everything. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says in Surah Raad, chapter 13, verse 33, He watches over the deeds of every person. My friends, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says in another verse, Surah Al-Munafiqun, chapter 63, verse 11, Allah is well aware of all that you do. My dear friends, Allah, my dear friends, always keep in mind that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala knows everything and He sees everything. He is with us all the time. So we should not do anything bad even in secret because Allah knows. My friends, when you feel all alone in this world, 
and there's nobody to count your tears just remember allah subhanahu wa ta'ala no matter where you are allah knows allah knows everything my friends allah subhanahu wa ta'ala questions to all mankind in quran surah al alaq chapter 96 verse 14 does he not know that allah sees everything my dear friends allah subhanahu wa ta'ala knows and is and is aware of all things nothing on earth or in heaven is hidden from him be it words words or deeds moments or sensations of moments acts of obedience or acts of disobedience allah is always watching us he knows what we do whether it is good or bad then he will tell us of that and will reward or punish us accordingly on the day of judgment okay my friends see you again with some new topic allow me till then